it's me, YD28, and welcome back to my channel with The Sims 2 Let's Play Strange Town. And we're here with the Spectre household, Nervous Subject, and Pascal Subject, and Janelle, and Sebastian. Um, I did a little bit of a renovating of the house a little bit. I decided um, to go with kind of an Asian theme. So it's a work in progress for now. Uh, it's not done, but they have uh, been using these chairs, which are Asian inspired. Um, and so, and they also have uh, some plants and decor items that are uh, quite Asian style. So I decided to just kind of go off that. So I just added uh, that dragon there. I picked these counters that to me just kind of, I don't know, they just look more Asian. And I upgrade. Ooh, I upgraded our entire kitchen because uh, it was quite low quality. So it's a new dark stove and dark fridge, and we got a dishwasher and a trash compactor and a food processor and a microwave, like hello. Uh, I also upgrade, oh, not upgraded, but I renovated the nursery. I decided, you know, the nursery should be a little warmer, so put carpet flooring and plaster and wallpaper the walls so that Sebastian's a little warmer because stone and wood or I think this is like sand brick or something like that flooring is quite cold um yes and I put new tile in the kitchen as well I like it I like it and I like these windows on the counters they're quite nice and I upgraded adding some plants these are like from the Asian folder and I added a plant in their hallway, and I added another end table and put some plants uh, in their room. And I changed the design of their dresser and just gave them two mirrors. Yeah. You see, the dresser is already here, and it is Asian-inspired. So, yes. And I threw out this fountain over here, which all you can do is add soap. So, that's kind of cool. But, yes. So, that's what I did. It is a work in progress. This will just keep going as we play sort of thing because I definitely don't want a Moroccan theme because they're not very um, South American Latino at all so yeah Miss Janelle I'm just getting her to get her fun up so she can go do her homework which she put somewhere I don't over here all the way over here which I'm gonna put it in her room you can't get away from it that easy girl so yeah, she's just going to get her needs up. Pascal is sick of the mysterious disease, so he is uh, bedridden for now. And a look at Nervous Subject taking care of Sebastian. How adorable. Put Sebastian back in his crib. Now Sebastian, I don't know, he either ages up to I think he ages up tomorrow. We're going to see in a second. Oh, okay, he doesn't age up at all. Okay. And Nervous Subject decided to go to sleep, so sure. <laughs> so sure. So we'll spend some time with Janelle. Now Miss Janelle, I don't remember what I decided I want her to do or be, but she's very, very neat and very, very nice and quite playful. So, um, I don't know. Let's see what else is better. She really likes paranormal and toys. Maybe she'll be our toy maker. Oh, that would be fun. She could be our toy maker. <laughs> but I'm going to get her to come take a bath and whatnot and probably grab some leftovers uh, so she could do her homework. Yes, and all the ghosts are out to play. Tonight we have Melissa Sims, Lorato Muende, who, oh my, your name is fancy. Miss, you're also very scary looking. I see your teeth. I can see your teeth. Oh, that's so creepy. It's only her bottom jaw. And her eyeball? Or her hair tie. I think that's her hair tie. But that is so gross. Oh my god. Who else? There's someone else out here. I saw. Oh, I thought I saw. Never mind. Okay. Yeah, the ghosts are out to play. As is always at the Spectre household. And look, here's Loki. Loki, go away. You are sick. Get away from our house. You are not coming inside. No more infecting my sims, please. So Miss Janelle is going to do her homework and then probably just go to bed. And, uh... 
Oh god, Pascal. Okay, okay, okay. Can we... Oh, nervous subject. Can... Can you... No. Please. Nervous subject. Oh, yes. Okay. Um... Yes. And then we'll do, uh, work. Once. Um, nervous subject, please. Come serve Grandma's comfort soup. Apparently Grandma's comfort soup cures all illnesses. So we need that done because Pascal is dying. Is it going to make the bed and relax? Except Nervous Subject doesn't know how to cook, so <laughs> we'll see how well this goes on our brand new fancy stove. That soup looks freaking delicious. It looks so hearty. Oh, you can see the chunks of carrot and potato mm, and like leek. Oh my goodness. Okay, Pascal, come. Come eat this. Oops. Come eat this right now. It's delicious and will help cure your illness. Is she done? Did she finish her homework? I think she did. I think she did. No, she didn't. It's over there. 84%. Well, looks like you'll be waking up early to uh, get that done, Missy. You gotta do your homework. And she wants a pet. Uh, we might get the, a pet for them. Maybe when Sebastian is a toddler or a child. Um, I think more when he's a child. It's just a lot of work to do. And these two are focused on their careers. They don't ha spend a lot of time home. So Janelle, like it would be for Janelle, and Janelle would have to take care of the pet, and if she's not home, she has school all day, so yeah, we'll see, but uh, tell me, Pascal, will you be cured? Super early at the spot, I can feel my sickness just melting away, he says as he pukes. Okay. Very well, I don't think that worked, because he threw it all up. I don't think it counts as curing you if you can't keep it down. So we're just going to put away all these leftovers and he'll have to uh, just eat it again later. But I'm going to put them all to bed and I will see you guys in the morning. And good morning, guys. Uh, Janelle and Pascal and Nervous Subject all have worked in school today, but Pascal does have nine vacation days, and I do want to use them up while Sebastian's a baby. So, um, Pascal's gonna take the day off. Ew, there are bugs. Don't get sick again. Come call the exterminator. Goodness gracious. So, yes, uh, Janelle's fun level is real low, though. So, I'm actually gonna get her to come watch TV, because those toys are not doing anything for her right now. So I'll watch some kids tube and we're calling an exterminator. Yes. And yes. And then she'll be heading off to school uh, now. Even though she or yeah, now. Even though she didn't finish her homework, she'll have to do it tonight when she gets home. Uh no, Pascal! Get out of the car. Okay, okay. Nervous? Nervous is going to work? You go make the bed. You go to school. And you can walk to work. There we go. And Pascal is just leave it alone. Pascal, Pascal, just leave it alone. Take care of the house and eat some leftover grandma's comfort soup. I'm finished for the day. Thank you, Miss Gardner. Goodness gracious, these Sims. What what do I do? Cool, okay. He killed the pests. Thank the Lord. Because that's no fun. We're going to fill that in. And, uh, make sure the place is looking snazzy. And I think I do want him to finish learning his physiology. It'll be funsies. And Sebastian, I think he ages up today, but I don't know. I don't know. Just doing that. Who is this? Trista Shaw. She sounds familiar. Let's take a look at her. Um, she doesn't look familiar. I don't know. 
But yes, this graveyard is just something else. There's just so many ghosts. I don't even know what to, how to begin. Benjamin Cho, I think I remember Benjamin Cho. It's just so many, but there's Olive and Ichabod and Luke Smith. Timely Demise, our oh, timely demise, ha ha ha. Euthanasia, like euthanasia. Early Demise, Rigor Mortis, Jessica Ibadi. Oh, Lorada and Paponi Muenda, she killed a couple. Yes, but these ones are uh, my favorite, I think. <laughs> Oh, it's just so punny. So, yes, Sir Sebastian. Oh, Sir Sebastian. I adore him. He's so cute. Oh, some of the cadets have decided to take the afternoon off and head downtown for some fun. They've invited Nervous along, but he's worried about performance reviews scheduled later in the day. He could stay and study up on the police handbook or head out and try to get to know the rest of the cadets. Um, he's awkward. He's not really anything, so he's going to stay back and study. Uh, blah, 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 uh, but they're impressed, and due to his recent studying, he answers that a 1642 is the radio call for regicide. The captain is impressed and nervous earns one logic skill point. Good job, nervous. See, it pays off to not socialize and make friends, sometimes. <laughs> but I want Sebastian to age up, like, now. Can we do it? <laughs> Can we do it? I just, I just want him to age up, like, right now. I want to see what he looks like. He's so cute. Just want to see, please. Please, we'll cuddle and play with him. And I didn't get the notification that he's cured. So I don't know. So we're going to take a bubble bath just in case. And then come and watch some TV. Oops. Oh, he went to sleep anyways. That's okay. And Janelle and Nervous should be coming back home soon. We got our vacation pay, which is lovely. <laughs> lovely. And we're just going to change his channel because, you yeah, know, he can't watch kids' cartoons. It just doesn't give him the same satisfaction. Like how they, he has like a fish face. He's just like, bop, bop, breathing. Oh, Pascal. <laughs> what is with that face? Why are you winking at me? Pascal. Oh, my heart. <laughs> Yes, but Janelle should be home now. She's in a terrible, terrible mood. Uh, yeah, she's in a terrible mood. So we're going to have to get her mood up. We'll probably come join and change it to... Uh, why does Laszlo want to talk to her? That's weird. What does Laszlo want? That's so weird. We're gonna change this kid's tube. And come take care of Sebastian. He needs his diaper changed. Oh my goodness, he's been crying for lord knows how long. <laughs> Poor Sebastian. We'll cuddle and play with him and then Pascal's gonna go to sleep because I think he's still sick and I don't want him dying on me. Because that would be very sad. Nervous subject just changed the channel on Janelle. Oh, she's feeling better now anyways. So she's going to go take a bath and then get some leftover food and then she'll have to come finish her homework. Because unfortunately it's not the weekend so you know girl you gotta, you gotta do your homework on a school night. It's appropriate. Nervous subject needs nothing to get promoted, it's just he's not doing well. It takes him forever. Man, you're never going to be a superhero. Maybe he should work out some more. How about you come jump rope? Sebastian's birthday is only a day away. It seems like only yesterday the little bundle of joy came into this world to grow up. Oh my goodness. I want him to age up now. Can we do it? You know what? We're buying a cake. We're aging him up today. Today, tomorrow, either way, yeah, no. I, I just want to see him age up. I want to see his face. I'm done with him being a baby. And we're just gonna uh, bring Sebastian to cake. And we're gonna do this. 
Sebastian, don't cry. Oh, Sebastian. Oh. Yeah, Pascal is like a model. He has like such a face. My goodness. Those glasses hide his hide his sexiness, but oh my goodness. Are we gonna do it? Oh my god, it's so cute. Look at his face. Oh my god, my heart. He stole my heart. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness, my heart. Pascal's like, who the heck behind me? Oh my goodness. Okay, let me see him. Put, put him down. Put him down. Hurry up! Oh my god, okay. Let me see him. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, I can't, I can't. Why are his eyes closed? Oh, he's so cute. Where is Nervous Subject taking him? Don't bathe him. Potty train him, though. He is adorable. Oh my god, I love him. He's such a cutie. Look at that bone structure. His face. Goodness. I'm happy. <laughs> I'm very happy. Uh, after we're going to come and plan his outfit. Oh, okay, never mind. But then we'll come change his appearance. Ooh. Alrighty. And I want him, he's wearing like a scarf and a sweater and it's like the desert out here. Uh, but I, I don't know. I kind of like this hair on him. It like suits his little face. He has such bone structure. I adore him so very much. Oh my God. He's just a sweetheart. Oh, I want to put face paint all over him. Look at him. <laughs> oh, anyways, we'll definitely need to get him some new clothes, cause dumb baby clothes ain't 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 doing it for me. No, no, no. There we go. There's Sir Sebastian. He's so cute. Oh my god, we can snuggle. Oh my god, Janelle! Where is she sleeping? She's so loud. Yep, she's sleeping in their bed, that's why. You snore so freaking loudly. Okay, can you... Can you get out of their bed? You're not supposed to! You're not supposed to. She wants to play peekaboo with Sebastian. Oh my god, we're gonna do it. Come play peekaboo. Play peekaboo! <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> I can't wait to play with her, mo with Janelle more. She's like so exciting to me. Uh, but she finished her homework. She does have to do her other homework. So I'm going to try and get her to do that. And I think I'm going to actually skip until tomorrow morning again. So I'll see you guys then. And good morning, everyone. Uh, Pascal is just serving cereal for his husband and child before they go away on their day. Pascal has Friday off, which is lovely. And he's going to take the weekend off to spend time with his family as well. And little Sebastian, uh, he apparently just pooped himself. But he's in his high chair having a grand old time. Um, just change his diaper. And uh, he needs to go down for another nap because he's been uh, kind of awake all, uh, all morning. Uh, but they aren't eating, so never mind. Sorry, Pascal. 
Never mind. My sims try to be nice and good and make breakfast for their family and their family just says like, nah. Thanks, but no thanks. Whatever. <laughs> uh, so we're gonna finish studying physiology while Sebastian sleeps. And I do want to get to teach him to talk and to walk and all that fun stuff. That would be real nice. So we're gonna dress him in his everyday. And he wants to learn a nursery rhyme too. But I think we will just, uh, no, not pick up it. We're gonna toss him in the air. And uh, I think tickle him or snuggle him. Snuggle, snuggle, snuggle. And then we'll teach him how to talk. Get that going. Oh wow, we're doing it in this tiny cramped room. Cause it's floor car it's floor carpeting. It's carpeting, carpet flooring, carpet flooring. I had a a day. I had a day. It wasn't even a long day, but I ate two Big Macs. Like I ordered two Big Macs, and I feel great, but I'm like, itist or tired or something. So my brain is just not functioning. But anyways. Sebastian just does not want to learn his words. Look at him, he's just like, no, don't tell me. Don't tell me how to talk, I don't want to talk. Oh, but I looked over Sebastian's things, and he is very outgoing and very playful and also very nice. And his interests are uh, animals. And kind of toys, but mostly just animals. Nothing else, really. He doesn't care about anything else. So, I'm thinking... Oh my goodness, Janelle. You seem like a pretty insightful person. I'm developing a new product, and I'd be interested in you to tell me how to do it. Oh, he has a co-worker. Who he likes? No, you have Pascal. We'll gossip and share our interests and entertain him and friendly hug him and maybe play toss a football because that'd be funsies. But Janelle, my darling, 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 sweetheart. Uh, she ages up in five days, so that's a while away. And uh, just so you guys know, I do plan on doing another round before we go to university with Rip Grunt. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about him. But I just there's just so much going on in Strange Town right now. I don't want to go away to university quite yet. So Rip is waiting there for us. And the teenagers are still quite young, so there's like tons of time for me to take them to university too. Um, not necessarily in the LP, I only want to really go once. So yeah, uh, but we're going to stop and potty train him and not cheer about <laughs> Janelle getting an A+, because who cares, really. You should, you're an alien. Aren't your brains like 10 times faster? Or more productive or something uh and then we're gonna put sebastian in his high chair and feed him some food and probably serve as some oh excuse me some spaghetti for dinners but miss thing is watching the weather station which is super boring she's gonna watch kids tube instead let's see what nervous subject is up to he's playing football with gerard landry but he's not being very nice about it because he's only active. That twitching and blinking a lot. Come on, you can do it. Alright, yeah, that's enough of that. <laughs> um, there we go. Oh, so I think he's going to put uh, Sebastian to his crib. And we're just going to uh, have a family, nice family sit-down dinner. Can you, don't bathe him. What are you doing? God. Why does he always want to bathe him? Okay, and we're all going to come around and eat some dinner. And have a nice family dinner where Nervous Subject eats like a rabid dog. Animal. 
Oh, Janelle's so sweet. This spaghetti though looks flippin' delicious. Oh, this guy is like hot. You'd think he has sunstroke like General Buzz Grunt had. And I don't know where he is. Where is he? Yeah, he's definitely sunstroked. He should leave or else he'll die here. And I don't want that. Okay, and go back to eat. Just leave so you don't die. And nervous subject is just done. So he's gonna clean up his dish. Oh, I should have got him to- no. Okay, lick it clean. I want you to lick it clean instead. Somehow that makes the plate just disappear. Done. Just like that. He's like, I cleaned my spot. And he's just gonna go away now. He's like, I am done. Bye. Bye. <laughs> So Janelle and Pascal are left. I don't know about you guys, but like in my family, once you're done eating, you sit at the table until everyone else is done eating, and then you get up. What about you guys? What's your family dinner etiquette? Do you have to stay at the table? Can you just leave when you're done? Do you have to clear everyone's plates if you did not cook? sort of thing every family is different so I'd like to know I'd be very intrigued but yes now everyone's done and it is a Friday night so I think Miss Janelle is going to uh, she actually cleaned up the dishes what a good little daughter I'm gonna get her to put away the dishes for her daddy because um, Pascal did cook and I think she's going to stay up for a little bit and play with her toys and maybe jump on her bed sort of thing because it is a Friday night and she doesn't have school tomorrow. So she's quite happy about that. And I think Pascal is cured of his mysterious disease because I haven't seen him coughing or anything. So good job. We cured him. We got it done. So yes, Miss Thing is going to clean herself up. And I'm going to end the part with her jumping on the bed ecstatically with ghosts in the background. <laughs> there we go. This is a perfect shot. Yes. <laughs> so if you guys enjoyed the part, please do give it a fat thumbs up and subscribe to me for more videos as I put them out fairly regularly. And I will see you guys next time. Bye guys.